and welcome to the 2013 SIGGRAPH Emerging Technologies venue. My name is Christy Prawn and I'm the Emerging Technologies producer this year. And on behalf of Dylan Moore, our committee chair, and our entire subcommittee, I'd like to welcome you to Emerging Technologies. Emerging Technologies brings together some of the latest, greatest technologies all through the industry. And this year we have a compilation of haptics, robotics, and our theme is also assistive technologies. So let's take a look at some of the really cool projects that we had this year at the 2013 SIGGRAPH Emerging Technologies venue. One of the great examples of our assistive technologies this year is IMI, which is a full body exoskeleton that's designed to help quadriplegics walk again. It's using BCI signals and it has two arms that have seven degrees of freedom that can also be used as haptic devices and the legs have three degrees of freedom. And this is a really, really great addition to emerging technologies this year. One of the examples of new display technology here at Emerging Technologies is the Near Eye Light Field Display. This is basically an example of a virtual reality headset, and it's meant to be lighter and cheaper than headsets that are out there today. It's brought to you by NVIDIA, and it uses micro-lensed uh, arrays and OLEDs. Transwall transforms a mundane glass wall into a rich interpersonal connective experience. This demonstration, you can see how someone on one side of the wall can work with someone on the other side of the wall through vibrotactile feedback, audio, and display technology. Illumaroom is a proof of concept system that's coming out of Microsoft Research right now. And basically what we're seeing is a traditional gaming experience. But when you use a projector and a Kinect the way that they have, it really transforms your entire room into the game. So this is a really interesting system and allows you to play not only on your 40-inch television, but now 15 feet of room. And as you're playing and you're going around shooting your environment, you can also see that other people are shooting at you. And you can see directly where they're shooting from because it's extending through the entire environment. So if you get a chance, you really need to see Light and Flight. This is a really, really cool project that is able to capture light as it propagates through a scene. And one of the interesting things about this is it's much cheaper than previous years, where it cost before about $200,000 to do, and this group's been able to do it for about $1,000. So these are just a few of the projects that you'll see at the SIGGRAPH Emerging Technologies venue. So come check us out this week.